Oh, she's gonna cry, man. He did his duty. You did your duty. Oh, this is making me want to cry. I want to burst in tears. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Mary. And if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. I am dressed like a ninja today for some reason. <laughs> Not for some reason. I'm watching The Last Samurai. I haven't really watched samurai movies on my channel. I've watched a lot of kung fu movies on my channel, but not many samurai movies. There was a bit of samurai stuff happening in John Wick 4, but I wouldn't call that a samurai movie. You know what I'm saying? So this is my first samurai movie and it's got Tom Cruise in it, who you guys know I have massively warmed up to considering I didn't watch any Tom Cruise movies before my channel. I think my first Tom Cruise movie that I watched on my channel must have been Rain Man. And that was during the time when I had the Patreon tier cherry pick what movie I should watch this month. I had that one open and somebody requested that I watch Rain Man. Uh, so that's what kind of opened the doors for me when it comes to Tom Cruise. But, you know, he's a great actor. And I can't deny that he is incredibly talented. He does his own stunts. We've seen that in Top Gun. Top Gun was incredible the way he was stunting around. <laughs> but yeah, I, I haven't read the blurb for this one. So I'm essentially walking into this one blind. And I like to do this because I like to be surprised and delighted. And most of the time, I am not upset about it. Most of the time I'm happy about it. So I am going to jump into this movie. But before we get started, I want to quickly talk about Patreon. If you guys want to support me, you can check out my Patreon linked in the description bar and the pinned comments down below. There you will find the uncut version. For the uncut version, you just need a copy of the film so that you can watch it along with me. There will be a timer and I can be on one screen and the movie could be on the other screen but besides on cuts i also provide early access to my content bloopers behind the scenes polls all of that good stuff and you can also find my two other channels my gaming channel cherry plays and my vlog channel very cherry as well as all my social media all the normal stuff is going to be linked down below so with all of that said let's watch the last samurai japan was made by a handful of brave men Warriors willing to give their lives for what seems to have become a forgotten word, honor. That much is true. I feel like today we often forget about honor. One of the most decorated warriors this country has ever known. Winner! He's drinking. Captain Nate Aldrin! Is that Tom Cruise's character or something? Ah, uh, yeah, it must be because he's not coming out. He is drunk as a skunk. <laughs> He is Chris McCabe, you are too kind. Not, he is not okay. Surrounded by a swarm of <sighs> angry, angry Yeah, you got this. Like those poor bastards out there on the little big horn. Left to rot in the sun. I feel like he's going off script here. <laughs> yeah, he's definitely going off script. Nathan Algren, I'd like you to meet Mr. O'Moore from Japan. And his associate, whose name I've given up trying to pronounce. <sighs> Sit down. Your performances for the Winchester Company bring you twenty-five dollars. He speaks week. great English. We will pay you four hundred dollars. Dang, a that's month. a big upgrade. Five, for each. That's this now. He's rude. No. That's no. how it is here, a land of cheap traders. The core back together again. It's just so. <laughs> He's acting very antisocial here. For 500 bucks a month, I'll kill whoever you want. But keep one thing in mind. I'd happily kill you for free. <laughs> Yokohama Harbor, 1876. Wow, how beautiful. Captain Organ, I presume? Hey, it's yes. oh, Jonathan, the rat from great. Harry Potter. It's like the ancient and the modern are at war for the soul of Japan. Ah, uh, so that's not good. It's all highly ritualized, of course. Damn, so many stairs, eh? Speak, and they're spoken to, obviously. If he stands, you must bow. If he bows, you must bow lower. Teaching him the ways. I love the politeness and the customs that they honor. Oh, we, wish I could speak Japanese. The emperor is most interested in your American Indians. They're very brave. 
Is he translating accurately? Because Peter Pettigrew earlier said he translates <laughs> lies. Thank He's so you. young, this emperor. Damn. Very much. Oh, he's such a sweetheart. For six months' work, I am to receive three years of captain's pay. Pretty good. Most of them are peasants who have never even seen a gun. Man, I feel bad for him. He fought with the samurai. He is samurai. Hello. <laughs> Flashback time. He's the only one here with a conscience. I am ordering the regiment to move against the rebel Katsumoto. Tell this man if he does not shoot me, I will kill him. What? Captain, if I might have a warrant. Oh. Kill him. What is wrong with him? Oh my god. He doesn't want to. He doesn't... Oh, he doesn't want to. Oh, poor guy. Oh my gosh. That's one quick way to learn. Crazy method, but a lesson oh he doesn't want to he's such a sweetheart Fire! do it don't kill him <laughs> imagine he kills him and that's the movie oh he's missing he's trying i think that was the point the point was just to shoot not to kill him poor guy they're not ready <laughs> the regiment leaves at 6 a.m that is not comforting. They're not ready, but they gotta move. Sergeant Gant, report to the rear. See to the disposition of the supply trains. No disrespect intended, sir, but shove it up your ass. Uh, oh. <laughs> Low! Kinda takes a long time to load guns in 1876. Assume firing position! Assume firing position! And it takes longer for these guys to get into their positions because it needs to be translated. What are they wearing? What is that? They're wearing some sort of helmet with horns. Hold your fire. They're not listening. Oh my God. Are you kidding? Idiots. Idiots. They're going to die. Oh my gosh. They're literally running away. Oh, dude. This is so bad. Oh! The man down! Oh. He's literally fighting with his gun. Oh! Like watching him with like eyes of. I don't know. Hope, maybe? Nathan won't give up. Oh, shoot. Nice. It was quick. <gasps> Stop. Maybe he was watching Nathan so intently because he saw a bit of samurai in him. Oh, no. Are they going to chop his head off? Oh, he fell on his sword. That's... Wait. Far out. Falling on your sword is a very samurai thing. It's to do with honor. I have heard. And check out the beautiful scenery. I've only been to Japan once. I've definitely not seen everything. What is your name? Insolent swine. Oh, it's still nothing. We are deep in the mountains and the winter is coming. You cannot escape. Charlie, good. Jolly good. <laughs> Why do you spare the barbarian? He is shamed in defeat. <laughs> that is not their custom. That's true. There will be plenty of killings to come. For now, we will learn about our new enemy. That's smart. Wow. He's mentally and physically not okay. That's all we <laughs> They're probably like, just give the man a drink. But he obviously means something different. He's admiring the way they train. This temple was built by my family a thousand years ago. My name is Katsumoto. Katsumoto. The warriors in your country do not kill. They don't cut the heads off defeated kneeling men. 
General Hasegawa asked me to help him and his... Oh. A samurai cannot stand the shame of defeat. <sighs> I was honored to raise his head. Who's the warrior in the red armor? My brother-in-law. And the woman who cares for me? My sister. Hirotaro's wife. Wait. I killed her husband? It was a good death. <gasps> He's shocked. He's like, I killed her husband and she's helping take care of me. probably wants to apologize make at least make him take a bow <laughs> <laughs> then she smiles at him no wonder she's happy to help because she can talk crap about him behind his back and he won't have a clue the way she's holding the chopsticks i'm so jealous oh bigger chopsticks those are for giants <laughs> Ah, uh, the alpha. Play. Wow. Come in. What's this guy's problem? I mean, what's his problem today? Because he always has a problem. Whew. Whoa, did you see that? Does it have to be in the rain? They couldn't have postponed this. He's all muddy now. He gets knocked down, but he gets up again. Oh. He doesn't know the ways yet. He needs to be trained. You are the general of your army? No. Surprisingly not. What do you want from me? What do you want for yourself? A question with a question. Why are we having these conversations? What the hell am I doing here? <laughs> He's like ready to fight him. I am their captive and then I cannot escape. Mostly I'm treated with a kind of a mild neglect. <laughs> mild, just mild. They are an intriguing people. From the moment they wake, they devote themselves to the perfection of whatever they pursue. I love that. I am surprised to learn that the word samurai means to serve. And that Katsumoto believes his rebellion to be in the service of the Emperor. Samurai to serve the Emperor. <laughs> They're actually teaching him now. Wow, look at him donning their attire. <laughs> First, he was giving them crap for wearing dresses. Now, he's wearing one of their... Well, it's not really a dress. It kind of looks like a dress. <laughs> <laughs> the kid's like, what are you doing? Uh, you didn't see nothing, kid. Uh, go, go walk away. Bow. Don't forget the bow. <laughs> <laughs> At this rate, he's going to be working with the samurai. Arigato. Arigato. Wow, look at him learning. Ogren. 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 They can't say his name. Nobutada. Nobu Tada Magojiro Magojiro Higen Taka. Yeah, she's a bit reserved. I don't blame her. Oh, please make me know I cannot stand it. The shame is unbearable. I ask permission to end my life. Damn, it's depressing her that much having him here. You'd rather forgive my weakness. There must be some reason why he is here. It is beyond my understanding. Quite a conundrum. They're in. What does it mean to be samurai? To devote yourself utterly to a set of moral principles. To seek a stillness of your mind. I would love stillness of the mind. It's like when I try and meditate, for example, I just think of everything. <laughs> it doesn't work. Hey, she's she's kind of smiling. There you go. Japanese men do not help with this. I'm not Japanese. Wow, he understood. He understood everything she just said. I'm sorry. Aw, the first time he said that to her. Komenasai. And he said it in Japanese husband. as well. Hirotaro. Oh, what a tender moment. Oh, she's gonna cry, man. He did his duty. You did your duty. Oh, this is making me want to cry. I want to burst in tears. I accept your apology. 
you can see the hurt in her eyes and her soul but her words are just still so polite and that's what's making me so emotional <gasps> i do know it is here that i have known my first untroubled sleep in many years yeah because he's had terrible ptsd and he's finding stillness in his mind <sighs> he's getting he's getting good like he's still kind of bad but I wouldn't expect you. I love that they were just betting on who was going to win. Ooh. The slow-mo. It's actually good slow-mo now because in his flashbacks it was... Ooh. Even Steven. Nice. He just gained that guy's respect, I think. The guy has hated him from the start. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god oh no this is really bad oh good he's he started to notice okay alert everyone everybody's so distracted are they even armed right now oh! who just got shot in the eye I don't know who the actor was, but they just got shot instead of Katsumoto. Ninjas. Literal ninjas. I feel I feel terrible because I'm looks like I'm on the ninja's side <laughs> with my outfit. Dang. Oh. This will be Nathan's shot to prove himself as a samurai. Oh my god, kid! Kid, I stay out, kid! Stay out, kid! No, kid, no, 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 no. Nathan has to get up. He has to win just so he can protect the kid. Protect the kid, protect the kid! Kid, what were you thinking? Hey, they survived. They survived together. And this has probably brought them closer together. Wow, the cherry blossom trees Perfect are beautiful. Blossom is a rare thing. Perfect blossom. You sent those men to kill you. I'm writing a poem about a dream I had. <laughs> He's just avoiding the question. You have nightmares? Oh. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Every soldier has nightmares. Only one who is ashamed of what he has done. Which Nathan's very ashamed. Like these poor subs. We are all dying. It's kind of depressing, but true. Life in every breath, every cup of tea, every life we take. The way of the warrior. Life in every breath. Life in every breath. The Emperor has granted a safe passage to Tokyo. We leave tomorrow. Great. Ikimas. I must go away. You have been so kind to me. Mm, I won't forget. <laughs> she's probably thinking about all the bad things she's ever said about him. And maybe just sad that he's leaving. She now feels something for him. I don't know. I'm getting that vibe. What's that little cutie? So sad, like they had such a long time of just happiness within the village, spending time together, learning about each other, and now it's time to go. Time to get real. Ooh, Tokyo in the 19th century. Ah, oh, there he is. I was wondering about him actually. The samurai are here. Everybody's freaking out for no reason. The emperor literally asked for them. I am sure that people are very shocked to see Nathan amongst the samurai. I need a bath. After living with those savages, I can only imagine. Savages? I do not like this guy. Tell me what to do. My teacher. You are emperor, my lord, not me. You must find the wisdom for all of us. But he's so lost. He's literally asking for help. You samurai, don't you know about the order? Captain Oh, leave him alone. Oh. Oh my God. They're gonna do it. 
at least hair grows back, my dude. Oh, poor dude. Mr. Katsumoto, great regret. I must ask you to remove your sword. The sword serves the Emperor. Only he can command me to remove it. What are you gonna do, Emperor? The Emperor's voice is too pure to be heard in this council. My guards will accompany you to your home in Tokyo there. You will await our summons. Emperor should have said something. Emperor, what the heck? Come on, intervene, Nathan. Intervene. Don't, don't drink another. He knows something's up, so he's just going to intervene. I feel like if he does, that will get him killed. Mm, and here we are. He's unarmed as well. That's not very honorable to kill a man that's not even armed. He doesn't need to be armed. Oh my god. I want to slow-mo this just so I can see... Tom doing his own stunts for real, for real. Uh-oh. Don't get stuck in the past for too long. <laughs> Samurai are finished. <laughs> Dang! He bad someone. How dare you show your sword in his presence? Do you know who this is? This is the president of the United States. <laughs> Carry the equipment. He's really good at crap talking. I decided to stay. See if I could convince you to escape. Wow. How did Frank do that? Oh. Oh. Like that. They're doing pretty well with their bow and arrows. <laughs> They're doing a lot better than the guys with actual guns. Oh, oh no. Oh my god, no way, no way. Come on. So much has changed for Nathan. Oh my gosh, they're too late. I think they're too late. Oh my god. Another loss in the family. It is my time. This is it. This is it for him. He's so young too. He's gonna make it count though he's gonna make his last moments count wow no he didn't have a chance oh, man the way of the samurai is not necessary anymore necessary that's what they're trying to make you think together we will make the emperor Yes, I like this plan. Don't like the defeatist mentality. Will you fight the white men too? If they come here, yes. Why? Good question. Because they come to destroy what I have come to love. My father taught me it is glorious to die in battle. He has to, kid. He has to. Poor little kid. It's so strange because Nathan killed his dad, but they've grown so fond of him. It's just such a beautiful way to treat your enemy. What does that mean? Algren-san, will you come with me? If you wear this armor, honor us. Oh my gosh, I knew it! Okay, if nothing happens in this scene, I'm gonna be very surprised because I have been sensing tension and a tense chemistry. Her husband is like in heaven right now and he's just like, what are you doing? <laughs> oh, I freaking knew! Look, I'm happy, but I can imagine the amount of conflict that Taka is probably going to go through. Yeah, it's weird. Yeah, she's she's emotional about this, man. You can see it. She's grown attached to the man that killed her husband. What does it say? I belong to the warrior in whom the old ways have joined the new. Oh, I like that. It's fitting. Surprise! God. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? You ride against us, and you are the same as they are. I'll look for you on the field. 
<laughs> Remember what he said to you earlier in the film, bro. He will kill you for free. He's looking forward to this. He's been waiting for this moment, this opportunity. Perhaps you can use these for your book. Captain. Godspeed. He has a bit of history in his hands. Man, that Japanese guy on the left looked really old. Not quite far enough. I love that they had no reaction to that as well. Oh! Now they have to move. What would you be thinking in those moments? Like, would you be praying? Would you just be thinking about your entire life? And then, I guess, happy that it didn't hit you this time? Wait for the volley. They'll actually listen to him. <gasps> Come on! Oh, look at that! Wow! Big impact. There's something so small? I'm very impressed by that. I mean, ouch. But holy crap, one arrow did all of that. And they're not gonna stop. Oh. Just flying arrows. How scary, what a sight. It's their turn. Their turn to get involved. Oh my god. This is crazy. Look at Tom go. Oh, look at them looking out for him. Oh my god. That's the old guy I was talking about earlier. And now he's dead. Rest in peace. Whoa, he just split his face in half. He's doing so well with a sword. Whoa, dude. Oh, Lord, look at him go. Two hands as well. The slow-mo, the classic slow-mo battle shot as people fall to the ground and blood spurts everywhere. And the heroes just... Taking everything in. Yeah. Dang, dude. He looks beaten up. I still think he could win. I mean, we've got the sad music playing. We've got the samurai dying. But wouldn't be right if they didn't miraculously win. Damn, dude. That guy looks real bad. He's defeated. He must accept his shame. And pull on his sword? Hell no. Nah. He's not defeated until he's defeated defeated. I was attempting to count them, but I'm not even going to try. They are outnumbered. That's all we have to know. The cannons, man. They're, they're just too much. And I feel so sorry for the horses. They must be scared scared to death. Do horses experience trauma? This music is just so intense. <laughs> I love his face. It's just so... It's like... Fire at will! He's gonna fire at you soon. Well, slice you in half, hopefully. The good thing about a sword is... Oh! <laughs> you don't need to reload that. He wasn't lying. He said he's gonna get him. Get your sword back though, bruv. Bring up the new guns. Oh my gosh. Oh. Does it even reach? Oh yeah, it does. It's reaching. It's reaching. It's killing the horses too. This is terrible. Oh my god. Poor horses and people. Sorry, I tend to think about the animals who have no idea what the heck is going on. Because at least the humans, they know what they're going into. They know what's coming. The horses are just like, oh, we're going for a ride. And then the next minute they're down. Oh, Tom's down. 
Oh my god, dude, this is brutal. Oh my gosh. Look at his face. What? Keep on firing. Stop. You heard him. Oh my god. No. You No, no, Katsumoto. No. No, you can't. This is terrible. Why can't he just say no? No, don't do it. Don't help him. I will miss our conversations. Don't do it. I love Katsumoto. Don't do it. No, he did it. Oh my god, Nathan is the last samurai. He is the last samurai. I need to get a tissue. He's so wholesome. There would be a lot more samurai if they didn't have that custom. At least they're showing their respect. It's a little too damn late. That's probably in their tradition, maybe, to do this. It's making the moment so much more emotional, though, because they all respected Katsumoto. It's just so terribly sad. Oh, I can't think about it, otherwise I'm going to cry again. This is Katsumoto's sword. He would have wanted you to have it. Let the strength of the samurai be with you always. Dude. How bad. He hoped. How bad would he feel? That you would remember the ancestors who held this sword and what they died for. Shut up! Honestly. Poor Emperor is just being influenced. You were with him at the end. Oh, those tears are a little too late, though, bro. Come on, like. Emperor, this man fought against you. Four. Your Highness, if you believe me to be your enemy, command me, and I will gladly take my life. Wow. Wow, that's huge. That's a... I dreamed of a unified Japan, strong and independent and modern. Can't forget the old ways, right? We cannot forget who we are. Good. Or where we come from. That's all Sukumoto wanted. Ambassador Swanbeck, I have concluded that your treaty is not in the best interest of my people. <laughs> so many people died for him to get to this. Enlightened one, we should discuss this. You have done quite enough, finally. Everything I've done, I've done for my country. And you will not mind when I seize your family's assets. Wow. And present them as my gift to the people. This shame is too unbearable. <laughs> you know what to do, pal. He's like, no, the, the shame's all right for me. Uh, I decided I can live with the shame. Tell me how he died. I will tell you how he died. That's a much better proposition. And so the days of the samurai had ended. In 1877? As for the American captain, no one knows what became of him. Oh. Some say that he died of his wound. Others that he returned to his own country. What? But I like to think he may have at last found some small measure of peace we all seek and few of us ever find. I would love it if he returned to the samurai village. Because, you know, the little kid, he was so afraid that he wouldn't return. And of course, there's Taka as well. Live out his days here. That's the ending I want to believe as well. Guys, I did not expect to cry in this movie. It was such an emotional roller coaster because Tom Cruise's character, Nathan, he starts off as this alcoholic, really depressed, hateful, not hateful to other people, I guess mainly hateful towards himself because he hates what he's done to the Native American people. And 
he hates the outcome and what have you and he's got a lot of ptsd with that and then he goes to this village i'm, I'm kind of skipping a few things <laughs> because i'm talking about his character progression but he goes to this village he meets katsumoto and at first he's not really welcomed there but then they begin to like and respect him and he gets over his alcoholism by the way in that scene where he was saying Saki, I completely forgot that he was an alcoholic. He was probably withdrawing from alcoholism because he had a wound as well. And I thought maybe he he's kind of in pain because of his infection and he's kind of delirious but if, but then i'm like wait he also had a problem with alcohol and i've never experienced that in my life or been around anyone that has been addicted to alcohol but i have seen depictions of withdrawing from drug addictions in film and tv shows and what have you and that's kind of what it looks like an alcohol is a drug and he was clearly just withdrawing from alcohol there throughout the entire period of his stay at this beautiful japanese village we don't see him drink any alcohol after that scene where he's uh begging for sake and i think it's just because the village just settled his mind it made his mind still and that was the perfect place for him to go to receive peace and I'm so happy for him because he came such a long way and him and Katsumoto just have this beautiful brotherly friendship, this brotherly bond and it's really beautiful because how did this come to be? They're supposed to be enemies, yet here they are and they're friends. So yeah, it was really lovely to see that. I was amazed by Tom Cruise's performance but I was expecting to be amazed by his performance he is a great actor and everybody knows that what I wasn't expecting was how much I loved Koyoki's performance as Taka she was incredible because she obviously went through so much having her husband killed and by the way the tension between Koyoki and Nathan was so palpable so intense throughout the entire film because Nathan killed her husband and she wants to just be done with this guy. She does not like him there, even though she's so polite and it's so admirable, it's so respectable to witness her bite her tongue and set aside all of her grievances and her own beliefs out of respect for Katsumoto. I also feel like I'm saying the not name wrong. It's Katsumoto, right? I swear I said the name wrong while I was reacting. Okay, it's Katsumoto. But yeah, anyway, yes, yeah, she sets aside her feelings towards Nathan and she just respects the word of Katsumoto because Katsumoto said, this is your guest and you must keep him here. And it's such a conflict. She is probably going through so many convictions in her head because she's also starting to develop feelings for Nathan. And that is the wildest thing, probably super unimaginable for her because this man literally just killed her husband and whilst she comes to the conclusion that her husband was just doing his duty and you were just doing your duty it doesn't make it any easier the fact of the matter is her husband still had to die and Katsumoto also still had to die and he died with his honor intact it's hard for me to understand it as a person who's not a samurai obviously but it's obviously something that's very important in their culture to die by disembowelment to die by your sword if you have dishonored yourself at the end of the day because Katsumoto did that and because that battle did happen however bloody it may be it made the emperor realize that he can't forget his roots Japan cannot forget their roots Japan can't forget where they came from despite embracing being modern that's fine it's fine to be modern it's fine to you know upgrade things but you can't forget where you came from that's what sets you apart from everybody else that's what makes you stand out that's what makes you beautiful and amazing and different and cool and he realized that it's just ugh, it's just so sad how much of a puppet he was for such a long time and how it had to come to death and destruction for him to finally have the courage to say something to make a decision for himself so it's really just it's so upsetting because i was so invested in these characters too especially katsumoto's family katsumoto's family were just the way they treated nathan 
who they kidnapped so respectfully and so beautifully. They fed him, they dressed him, they helped him get over his alcoholism. You know, they just treated him with such honor. That's the only word that I have, but they treated him with such honor. And sorry, it's just so sad that he lost so much that all of them just lost so much so yeah i loved ken watanabe and koyoku's performance so much i was already expecting to love tom cruise's performance but those two just astounded me they were amazing and i also really loved the score and the scenery of course i mean the scenery is japan if you've ever been to japan you know it's a beautiful country so it was really beautiful to see japan no japanese set film because japan's stunning and the score was so powerful too there were a lot of crazy shots it was a very bloody film but it was a beautiful story japan recognizing that they can be modern but also accept where they came from and taka and nathan finding each other after it all ends well that's what we like to believe or like to think that's the romanticized version of the story and that's the one that i choose to accept in my heart because that's the most beautiful taka i guess accepting the man that killed her husband because they were both doing their own duties respectfully and nathan's actually a good man so yeah i mean he's also really good to her kids and he's been great to her family as well great story really impactful and i learned a little bit about this time in history for japan which was, was enlightening i don't really watch a lot of period pieces myself so it was great to cross this one off the list so thank you so much for watching and if you have any other samurai movies that you really love leave them in the comments below let me know what your thoughts about this film is i'd really love to hear them down below give this video a big old thumbs up because it really helps your girls channel out and if you're after the uncut version you can find that over on patreon which is linked in the description bar and in the pinned comments down below you just need a copy of the film so that you can watch it along with me there will be a timer i can be on one screen and the movie can be on the other screen besides uncuts i also provide early access to my content bloopers behind the scenes polls all that good stuff and down below you can find me in all the social media handles as well instagram twitter twitch discord tiktok facebook as well as my two other channels my gaming channel cherry plays and my vlog channel very cherry okay guys thank you so much for watching take care of yourselves and i'll see you in the next one bye everyone